Botswana Premier League 2022-2023 season will start in two weeks' time without a sponsor and grant. This was revealed over the weekend in a Botswana Football League annual General Assembly closed session. During the official opening of the assembly, the guest speaker, who is also the Botswana Football Association President Matlin Litwiti, expressed disappointment over clubs failing to comply with the club licensing requirements. Litwiti said this is likely to repeat this coming season when clubs will start the league without any grants to sustain them. You are the voice of football. I see in the media when anybody, any club, your members, put statement on the press and you don't do anything. So if you don't do anything, I'm going to do something. You know, if Infantino, when he came into power, he did not take action, suspend, expel. FIFA would be where it was 20 years ago. Today, FIFA is the most profitable organization. Ten times than it was when it took over. There's integrity, there's transparency, there's governance. And I think you can do all those things without me telling you. You are a businessman. Your board is composed of business people. Do the right thing. So, these three things, sponsorship, behavior of your officials and members. I don't like it. I don't like it. And it's not my duty to come and reprimand your, your, your people. And they're just doing that in front of you. You can even do simple things. And you blame BFA. You actually, your teams, your members, Mr. Chairman, are the cause of you losing sponsorships by your bad conduct by your members. Let me be very clear, Mr. Chairman. You've been lenient. The loss of the game is that you, the spokesman, of BFL. Some of your members go to papers and make comments about football. I was watching. That's why I'm saying I don't know whether I will sit next to you. I was watching you. You failed to take action at an appropriate stage. And I'm saying that's not going to happen because that tarnishes the name of football. I'm just not a leader of Botswana football. I'm a leader for African football. Whatever happens in Botswana, people are looking at me because I'm leading them. And you fail to take action on many things. And I was just watching. Now, let me be frank with you, Mr. Chairman. I am not now going to be watching. I'm going to be taking action against you. And you have to take action against your members. Among other things which made clubs fail to satisfy the club licensing manual was failure to pay coaches and players salaries. Four Premier League teams, Morupule Wanderers, Extension Gunners, Mogodisane Fighters, and the newly promoted 11 Angels had failed to meet club licensing requirements. They were, however, successful in their appeals and were subsequently pardoned by the Botswana Football Association's Appeals Board. Litswiti said when Botswana Football Association gave BFL the opportunity to run as a company in 2020, negotiations with potential sponsors KBL were at an advanced stage. He said the only thing left was to finalize talks with the Minister of Trade. You know what I'm talking about. You know that you are the people... The, 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 uh, De destroying the reputation of football. You know what I'm talking about. Don't pretend. Huh? When you lose sponsorship, you say it's me. It's you losing sponsorships. It's not me. All my sponsorships are intact. Orange is intact. Lucky Tell is intact. First Division is intact. You name it. Chobis is intact. We haven't lost We've actually built more sponsorships. The sponsorships that were lost were you because you did not do the right things. 
and I'm not going to watch him. It's over now. I can tell you, Mr. Chairman. It's over. It's either you stop me from interfering in your affairs by doing something, or I'll tell you to go and run your teams, and then I'll, I'll, I'll run the transformation. Pusham Lilo, reporting for The Voice Online.